Welcome to another photo booth upload video tutorial. In this video tutorial, I'm going to cover the page designer feature within the software. So the page designer really allows you to create your page layout. And this is where you'll determine how many photos are taken per session and how they're arranged on your final print or uploaded file. We're really excited to show you this new feature because it's very simple, it's very easy to use. Uh, we simply drag and drop our photos into this template and it's very nice to create, let's say, a template with some more branding opportunities as I've done here with this gold background. You could also do photo strips or any other assortment of photos and it's very easy to do it. So to start, first we'll launch Photo Booth Upload and we'll click on S on our keyboard to enter the settings screen. So once we're in the settings, we can click on Page Designer up here at the top and I'm going to recreate this page design that you can see here with three photos. So to do that, we'll click on the button that says create new page layout. And now by default, there's already a photo holder with the number one, the red square. So I'll remove that to start fresh. Now the page design that I'm designing is a six by four, but we can adjust this with these up and down arrows. So I'll start with a six by four and I'm going to load an overlay image that I've created in Photoshop. So I have already created this 6x4 PNG file in Photoshop. Now within that 6x4, I set these white squares where I want the photos to appear. So to do that, I head over to the photo holder section and I click on this plus sign. And so I want the first photo to be a 4x6 photo I'll click on OK, and that will pop up this red square that says number one. But the red square is smaller than the white square where I want the photo to appear. So to enlarge this photo, I just simply right click and I can drag down to make that photo a little bit, a little bit larger. And so now I need to rotate this because that white square is a little tilted to the left. And I can easily rotate this by hitting control and left click and that just simply rotates that photo holder so I'll just stick it in the top left hand corner and I'll hit the right click on the mouse and I'll just make it a little bit bigger to fill that white square and that's it and I'll repeat those steps plus sign 4 by 6 OK here's photo number 2 control and left click and I'll just simply rotate that a little bit, stick it in this top left corner, and I'll right click, drag down to make it a little bit bigger. And that nicely fits that white square. And I'll just repeat that step for photo number three. There's my red square for photo number three. I'll rotate it just a little bit. And I'll stick it in this white square make it a little bit bigger and that's it that's really all we need to do now we can export this page design so that we can do this only once and reuse the same page design later if we want to so we can click on export and then save that file and then we would import the file if we wanted to import it later so I'll click on OK and you can see that my page design shows up right here and I can select it and that's really all we need to do that's how you use the page designer within Photo Booth Upload. I hope you found this video tutorial helpful. If you have any questions, please contact us at photopartystation.com. Thank you.